Hey, Jewel Heist. My name is Kelly Jones. I am a senior gold ambassador and it is my great privilege to get to spend a few minutes with you today talking about mindset. I'm coming to you from my classroom. I am a high school math teacher. I teach students who really struggle in math. They're the ones that don't like math yet. Hopefully by the time they finish with me, they realize that it's not so bad and it's something they actually can do. I wanted to share with you um, about the concept of mindset because when Lindsay asked us to um, do this for y'all, I knew that that was something that I not only could speak to you, but that I needed to speak to you because you just might be like me. You know, your experience may have been a little bit like mine and um, that's what I, what I wanna share with you because I know that I can only give away to you what I've received myself. And I have had um, just a tremendous blessing over the past year in the arena of mindset. So, little background, um, I've been with Plexus for about three years and um, initially jumped in like so many of us do um, because of the products and very quickly uh, realized that adding the products to our family was having a profound and wonderful life-changing impact on our youngest daughter who was struggling with anxiety and depression. Um, truly, for the first few years with Plexus, my passion was to understand what kind of magic is this and how did it make such a difference in her life. Um, and I'd love to tell you more about that sometime, but that's not why we're here today. Over the past um, calendar year, the concept of mindset has been of critical interest for me. And I'll tell you why. There has been a season where I have had begun to become or to feel somewhat isolated um, on my team. I did not have a particularly active upline and my downline was becoming more and more quiet as the year went by. And I found myself feeling a little bit drifty, a little bit alone. And um, as a teacher, I know that, you know, through the school year, I'm dividing my time between working full time and working in my plexus business. But y'all, summertime for me, that's go time. That is when I have a lot of, of time where I can be truly intentional and purposeful and um, much more um, engaged and involved in things like personal growth. Um, and that is what the Lord has done for me through this summer. Guys, do you realize that we are on the best team in Plexus? Maybe you hear that, but I just want you to know that over the past three years, I know for a fact that that is absolutely true. We have got an amazing team here on Jewel Heist and our leaders, Lindsay and Julia, provide for us some of the best resources uh, for us to use to help us grow, to grow personally, to grow um, in our business activities, to grow our teams. And so for the past three years, I have taken part in what they've offered us here on Jewel Heist. Um, this past summer, it was called the Jewel Heist Pool Party. Y'all, I'm talking about the groups where our leaders say, hey, do you wanna be a part of this and do like a little summer challenge? And each summer I've said, yes, yes, I do. I wanna be a part of that. And y'all, this summer was literally life changing for me because I was so blessed to be partnered with women who are, they're not in my upline, they're not in my downline. These are just sideline sisters and we came alongside each other in a way that was truly profound. And here's what I realized. It helps so much. It matters who you hang out with, y'all. If you are finding yourself surrounded by um, negativity, and I hate to even say the word out loud, but it's true, you know it's out there. If you find yourself in a surrounding where things are not full of positive energy, um, encouragement, life-giving words, support, um, tools that help to grow you in your leadership skills and your ability. If you're not surrounded by like-minded runners, then you need to be. 
because it can change your life. It can change your business. It can totally change your mindset. It's done that for me, y'all. It has. And so I'm not trying to reinvent the wheel here, but I am going to give you a really solid endorsement. Number one for our team here with Jewel Heist. It's amazing. Number two, if our leaders offer you something to take part of, do it. Do it. Plug in. You may find yourself as blessed as I have been to connect with some amazingly phenomenal women who I truly respect and who, I'm, who I have grown to love and who I pray will continue to be close friends of mine throughout the remainder of our tenure with this wonderful company. Y'all, it's what happens between the ears. It's your thoughts. It's the power of putting the scripture to bear that says, whatsoever things are true, what is noble, what is right, what is pure, what is lovely, what is admirable, the things that are excellent and praiseworthy, think on these things. That is what I have found through the incredible women I've been surrounded with this summer. That is what I know can be true for you too. Guys, we have every reason to hold our head high as we represent our company. Look, you know the products work, they do. But if you don't know the integrity of our leadership from the very tip top all the way down to me. If you don't know that, then I invite you to come. Come with me, come and find out, come and explore until you believe that you are in the very best, best place at the very best time with the very best company. Y'all, I want you to know that one of the other hats that I wear is that I am a pastor's wife. Y'all, I am accustomed to living life in the fishbowl. Truly, as an educator, as a public educator, I've got people watching me all the time. My students watch me every day, all day. It matters how I live my life. My administrators watch. The community watches. But as a pastor's wife, that's also uh, another arena in which we live our life in a fishbowl. We are accustomed to knowing that what we say and what we do and how we live our lives is very often under the observation, if not scrutiny, of others. Why am I telling you that? Because I could not wear my plexus banner with any greater honor or pride than I do. Yes, I represent the Lord in my community. I represent my school. I represent my husband as my pastor. And I know that part of what I bring, part of what I portray, is that I am a very proud and thankful and grateful Plexus Ambassador. You can do this, friends. You can wear your Plexus banner with pride, just like I do, because we hold the belief, we know that it is solid and true, that we are with a company that does network marketing the way it should be done, but very rarely is. You are in a safe place here, my friends. You are with a fabulous company. You are on the best team in Plexus, and you have the opportunity to surround yourself with men and women who are like-minded, who are positive and moving forward in a way that can truly impact your business. So, yep, it matters who you hang out with. It matters who you're representing. We can do that with pride with Plexus. And it matters what you're thinking about. So I encourage you to think on these things, my friends. Think on these things. And when you do, and you are becoming the leader that the Lord desires to create you to be, you're going to find that your business will grow from the overflow. It's been true for me. And I'm so, so grateful. And so um, I pray that this series has been a blessing to you. It certainly has been to me. And um, I just want to say thanks. Thanks for hanging out with me for just a little while today. Bye.